<laughs> Just Bricks here with another video for you. Happy Halloween, everybody. Got my Magic Screams hoodie on. Got this when I worked at an amusement park in Arkansas back in 2009. Uh... 11 and 12, I believe. And then today I've got my voodoo. But starting tomorrow, I can have my merry mashup. Because, I mean, you know, the day after Christmas, the day after Halloween, it's Christmas. <laughs> All right, let's get these lights on. I'm going to go ahead and pick an order. I got another order for Doug. He's ordered from me before, and I told him I'd do another Pablo for him. And he's got some more interesting pieces, so let's get into that. This might have been a bad idea. Oh yeah, that, that, that was not a good plan. Hopefully that doesn't set off the fire alarm. Well, <clears throat> I mean, it is Halloween. <laughs> oh, goodness. This, the fire alarm did go off. Okay, so starting off Doug's order, we got a few pieces from drawer two and a couple pieces from drawer three, so I'll go ahead and pull those two drawers out at the same time. Okay, I just saw that piece there the other day. I don't remember what set that came from. It's a cool little piece. Ah, there it is. Definitely need to put those in their one by one printed pieces in their own drawer because it's gotten a little crowded here. Let's see. And then, oh, I bought a piece that I just added the other day. That rug tile there that came from a poly bag set from um, Cinderella. It's like mini castle or something like that. I just added that like two days ago. And there we go. Let's see what else we got. He's got new wands. There's only one of them. I believe that's from Harry Potter figures. Yeah, I um I got a couple of figures, built them, put the wands in our hands, and then listed the second wand from those sets. See, still on the sprue, so still new. And where's the other one? There it is. And a dark brown one. Okay, and there you go, got that. I'd like to thank Doug for this order. Um, met Doug through the uh, Just Brick and Bucket guys through the Discord. He's been a real encouragement as I've been starting my store. I know he's planning on starting a store and YouTube channel here and before too much longer. So when he does that, I'll make sure I, I give him a shout out. Not that my channel is exactly huge, <laughs> but I'll make sure to, make, to let people know when he started his YouTube channel. I already told him I want to be one of his first subscribers. <laughs> because he's been a big help to me and it's been really cool just getting to know him let's see oh we got one of my green guys i already looked over this order so i know that doug bought one of each of my little minifigure statues so it's pretty cool i'm glad of that They're neat little things, neat little pieces, that's for sure. Oh, just in time for Halloween, he got himself a skeleton with the 
floppy arms. And yeah, so I got the fog machine turned off because that was a bad idea. I got it all down. I, I, I had to take the smoke detector down temporarily. I have to put it up after the video's over. Let's see, four of those guys. Oh, also in time for, just in time for Halloween, I bought some pumpkins. This one I already had out because I never put the drawer away once I put the pieces in it. Because <laughs> I just added that a couple days ago. And he bought two of the red pumpkins. Oh, while I was pulling out my fog machine earlier, I found the otter and the, the um, rabbit that I couldn't find for the life of me the other day. Oh, look at that. That's, that's cool. I actually just added these parts not too long ago as well. I put them in their own little baggie just because, I mean, $5.05. .05. .05. I, I bought the uh, Sanctum Santorum set not too long ago. I think all the parts that you bought, Doug, came f from things I've bought in the last, like, three weeks. <laughs> So, or the last month or so. Definitely since the last time you ordered from me. All right. Oh, 257. Mm -hmm. Next door over. We got both of my Lego Movie 2 Benny's toolboxes. Let's see. I was saying something. I don't remember what I was talking about before. Also, our rugby ball. Drawer over. What was this one? Uh, shield from the Viking CMF. There we go. And yeah, all these pieces have been added quite recently to my inventory. Oh, and there they go. One of those. Oh, same drawer again. Also from CMF. Oh, different drawer. 302. Actually, it's 303. I put the wrong number there for some reason. Gotta get the uh, sea turtles. Can never say that without saying it. Like the Pirates of the Caribbean. <laughs> sea turtles, mate. Sea turtles. Alright, and, and here we go. All right, those are all in drawer 338, which is one of my newest drawers. I have just started using these, 338. I don't know if you can see it, but I put the shelf up a while ago and I realized that the Acro Mills containers fit on it. So I'm probably gonna put a couple, a couple more on these shelves. Let's see what we got. Got one of those, 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 and one of those. Okay, so I'm gonna get those off camera. There we go, one of each of them. I'll double check. After my last Pablo video, I wanna make sure that I check everything twice before I pack it all up. <laughs> Because I'd, I'd really rather not have to reopen this package. <laughs> and blue drawer one. One of the last two. I should check and make sure I kept one of those. I think I did. I don't. Oh, yeah, there it is. Good, I kept one of my animals. When I ordered these, I made sure I got enough so I could be, like once I sold, once I sold all three of them, I'd be able to pay for the one I kept. 
But, okay, there's one of those. Oh, and back down back there. The next part came from Blue Drawer 3. This big old nasty thing. I don't really remember. I think this came from some like Junior's Pirate set. Um, got it in a bulk lot. It's an interesting thing, that's for sure. Dresser drawer one. I don't normally list the instructions, but I've been saving them, throwing them up in here. So, ouch. Just stepped on something. Not a Lego, though. So in here somewhere are the instructions for the Sanctum Sanctorum. That is the one set, right? Yep. There they are. There's book one and book two. It's a, it's a cool set. I'm going to go ahead and skip over a couple things and then come back to them because I want to do the organizers last. Um, got some instructions. Stuff too. It's because this set of drawers here it says stuff on it because I had this since I was a teenager and stuff too has let's see instructions six three four six I just realized this is a European version of the sets. Hmm. I don't. I don't know if I made that distinction on there. Well, actually, clearly I didn't because it doesn't say it. But Doug, I guess you're getting the European version of those instructions. I hope that's not a problem. Let's see, drawer U eighty two. So it's the used part. The Empire State Building tile with some scuffs on it. Let's see if we can get that. Okay, so there's that. And then this tile from one of the Hobbit sets. And I put on there that the sticker's a bit crooked because it is. And a sticker with a hole in it that goes around the stud. That's just a recipe for disaster. It's got disaster written all over it. If anybody actually understands that reference, um, well, five points to Gryffindor. All right, so I got my organizers, just the ones that I need. Uh, let's see, OA9. We got a scared Jack Sparrow. OC3. We got... Oh, OC. Zog from the Harry Potter movies. This guy was also for my $15 Facebook haul. And so, Doug, thanks for that, because that, that haul definitely has been worth the time and effort. <laughs> oh, and the, uh, the next one is actually from that lot as well. Yeoman Zombie. Come on. Yeoman Zombie. What's funny is the um, Azog. Why is my camera just not focusing on anything right now? The uh, Azog there was completely disassembled. And I was a little nervous, but he's he's in good condition. No, no noticeable scratches, definitely no cracks or anything. Okay, so... Next is the pouch. All the parts from Organizer D. So we got this sand green pouch. We've got um, pearl gold size. One, two, dark pearl gray. 
a pearl dark gray. Both of those. Uh, flat silver. That's in see five. So in here, one of those. All three of my bionicle Zamphor spheres, Zamwar spheres. Those are really hard to list accurately. I, I went with the one that looked the closest in the picture. Um, it's not very easy to tell which ones you have because the colors just, I don't know, something about them. The colors in the pictures don't seem like they're really matching everything else. Okay, he bought my artist palette and the uh, paintbrush there. I know that this Pop Pop's Block Shop uses those for his signature figure, Sig Fig OD20. That's uh, down here, that one right there. He bought one of the shields from Dimensions. Got that. Okay. OD21, flat silver and pearl gold. Got them. Uh, light bluish gray syringe. 25. That's down here. Light bluish gray. Doug, you got some cool pieces again. Let's see. I should probably just look over the camera instead of trying to look through the screen on a camera to grab it. <laughs> and OD30 ball. All my eggs. All the eggs. Doug, if I... If I had known you wanted eggs, I would have gotten a full dozen. <laughs> and that's the last piece. But yeah, Doug, thanks again for your order. I'm going to go ahead and make sure I get this in the mail. I'm going to finish enjoying my voodoo. Until the next video, happy Halloween. Y'all have a good one.